time to die, Mr. Wizard. Let's see, Wizard, not a problem. Sigil of the Magus. Well, that does it for all the tombs. Ah, oh, had to come down in this one. All right, let's follow the arrows the opposite way. Which obviously is not this way. Let's just look at the map. It's probably no, not there. Menelkir's tomb. I know they all have names, but I don't remember them. Oh, there's one right up here. Apparently, there's a portal up here I missed. Ah, I see. All right, now. Oh, it actually auto saved, so I'll be good. Let's keep going. Now we need to get around to that place where I put them all in. This place. I think I have a torch. No, maybe I don't. Well, let's save. Because I know what this place is. I think there's like a thing you can do back here. Maybe not. Well. I'm just going to save at this door, because I know what's in here, and I want you to see it before I whoop the living hell out of it. Yep, that's right, it's Korax. Ouch! Swept from the board by Korax. Oh, Korax. Yes, I know I'm not playing. I'm going to go in the load. Basically, the deal here is that Korax tries to punk shoot you. I'm not sure if you have to be invincible for when he does it, but I think when he kills you, it's always you were swept from the board. <clears throat> See, he teleports away. At least he didn't drop the ceiling out in the lava, or the floor out in the lava. Alright, uh, let's just... God, ends are so stupid. Oh. might actually be the last episode. Uh, 
shit, I have no mana. Uh, thank you. You know what? Pork later time. It's not so bad when there's like a few, but this is never a few. Ouch! Forgot about those, they crush you. Alright, let's beat him the traditional way and use Discs and Propulsion otherwise, because I can't use too much more mana. Korax? I forgot he kind of does a teleport around thing now. Well, since we're at this point, let's save. Yep, telefragged. Look at his feet. Are you Korak? Stop hiding like a bitch. Well, Korax is dead. I know not to stand near him. I think he like explodes. Ha, ah, you're dead. How do you like that? Me, two. Serpent Riders, like 8,000 technically, but zero. And mana for no purpose. I mean, I think those doors only open if, there's a, if you do all the secret levels, but I'm not sure. With a scream of agony, you are wrenched from this world into another. Every part of your body wreathed in mystical fire, or mystic fire. When your vision clears, you find yourself standing in a great hall filled with ghostly echoes, filled with ghostly echoes, durr, and menacing shadows. In the distance, you can see a raised dais, and upon it, the only source of light in this world. This can only be the Chaos Sphere, the source of Korax's power. With this, you can create worlds, or destroy them. By rights of battle and conquest, it is yours. And with trembling hands, you reach to grasp it. Perhaps now, a new player will join the cosmic game of power. Like the pawn who is promoted to queen, Suddenly, the very reaches of the board seem to be within your grasp. But there are other players mightier than you. 
and who can know their next moves? Yay! Cosmic Game of Power, played in chess. And I believe that's it. That's literally the end of the game. It's leading you into a sequel. It says, way to go, you've killed another Serpent Rider, but there's still more remaining. And it is kind of a ripoff. The Korax doesn't actually ride a Serpent. He's more like somewhere in between a Serpent, but... I understand. I mean, he's a beast from another dimension who's conquering the world, so... Well, I could just sit here and let this play out. And that red hand actually is, I believe, I keep saying it, uh, Eidolon or Edelon. Ah, and Hexen too. Music stop. But, ah, uh, yeah. So, I don't know. I wish they'd have continued it and done all of the Serpent Riders or remake the game in like five parts or six parts, however many Serpent Riders there are, and just kind of, I don't know, give it a classic feel but remake it like they did Wolfenstein, and you kind of just, maybe you play as other characters as you go through the worlds, because that would be kind of awesome. You know, pick three characters to fight just Feral. Pick one of three characters to fight you know, this one. And that way it's kind of like a new game every time you go to fight a Serpent Rider. But that would be pretty awesome. But, eh, they're probably never going to do it. But, either way, this has been Hexen Beyond Heretic. And, uh, I'm going to at some point show you all the other weapons, but not now. Well, see you later.